can ask him. He's a pretty cool guy. That'd be so great. What'd be so great? Oh, well, Chris knows that guy, Ben. Yeah. Who runs that bookshop Hawkins on Reynolds and is gonna try and get me an interview. I'll let you know what he says. Thank you so much. Oh, no worries. See ya. You sure you're ready to go back to work? Well, the sooner I can get a job, the sooner you can get rid of me. I don't want to get rid of you. And I don't want to be sleeping on your couch for the next six months. Some new cases came in this morning. Yeah, just leave them on the desk. Was there something else? Look, about the other night, I just wanted yeah, to Yeah, I don't have time. I've got all this work to do. Well, if you get a chance... Yeah, I know where your office is. I spoke to Ben. He wants to see you tomorrow at 6. You're fantastic. I know. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Good luck. Thanks. She said why? When's she leaving? No, thanks for letting me know. I appreciate it. Thanks. Bye. You okay? Yep. You expect me to believe that? You look like your dog just got run over. I don't have a dog. Well, then we ruled that out. Augusta has a dog. It's Augusta. No. You sure you don't want to talk about it? I don't think that's a good idea. You don't need to protect me. You can't tell me. Fine. That was Trish. Emily's resigned. She's leaving in four weeks. shouldn't have told you. This is weird. Yeah, it is. Hi. What do you want? Trish told me you were leaving. Good news travels fast. Can you at least hear me out? I might not see you again. Yep. That's the plan. Em. I'm sick of listening to you. I'm sick of your lies and your bullshit. I didn't lie to you. Just don't think. You do whatever you want and you don't care how it's going to affect anyone but yourself. You really hurt me, Steph. I know. You can't just keep doing that and expect some stupid apology that's going to make up for it. Ben? You must be Darcy. Hi. Um, take a seat. Thanks. Thanks for seeing me. Oh, it's fine. So how do you know Chris? Oh, um, I'm, I, I, I'm staying with them for a while. Oh. Chris is great. So much fun. I've known Chris for years now. We met at this bar on Oxford Street. Where you mean? <laughs> this guy I was dating at the time, he knew a girl that Chris was dating. And, um, and, um. No, no, wait, hey, wait, hang on. about um, old mate in the jacket. Uh, I swear, every time I see him outside of court, he's wearing the exact same thing. And he pretends he doesn't see you. Mm. That's such a big time. Would anyone else like another drink? Mm. I'll go another one. Mm -hmm. I'm okay, thanks. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, and it's a 
Pomeranian dog. Is that what it is? I could never tell what kind of... Okay.